What's up, YouTube? Atlas here. Today I wanted to show you guys how to instantly invoke a spell on Invoker. Uh, you may see people in your games invoke spells crazy fast. Either they've got really fast fingers, or they're using a script to do it for them. Now, I mean, I'm not saying it's impossible to invoke and nearly instantly with your with your own fingers. I can do it. Dendi can do it. If you've ever watched a video of Dendi playing Invoker, it's it's quite interesting. He does spells crazy fast. He's way better at Invoker than I will ever be. Uh, but, I mean, just watch a, a video of Dendi practicing Invoker. He just goes into WTF mode and sits there and spams spells and does it as fast as he can, does all these combos. It's uh, it's quite interesting, and if you're looking for a way to practice Invoker, just watch what he does. It's pretty good. It's a pretty good method. Uh, if you guys noticed, I actually have been off of... I haven't posted anything in four months. Uh, I've been kind of taking a, a little bit of a hiatus since I've been very busy. Uh, so anyway, let's go ahead and get into this. I'm going to show you where you put the script and what it looks like, and then we'll go into the game and actually use it. Alright, so first you want to go over to Dota 2, right click, go down to Properties, you'll start over in this general section and go over to Local Files, Browse Local Files, click on Dota, and CFG. CFG stands for Config, you'll actually, there is a Config file here, but that's not what you want. Uh, it's Configurations, uh, and you'll notice you won't have all of these, you probably won't see any of this actually. I've got several things set up in here, uh, like my auto exec. Yeah, uh, this is for a very complicated keyboard setup. Uh, as you can see, some uh, I I did not make this. There's no way I would have been able to make this. This is incredibly complicated. All credit to the guy who actually made it. I can't remember his name. Maybe it's on here. Oh, Lupulisas. Okay, yeah. If you actually want to look this up, just Google this, Loop Police is Super Compact Dota 2 Keybinds. Uh, it's very hard, it's kind of hard, it's not very hard to learn, but it's kind of hard to learn, but it's very much worth it. There's a lot of cool things in there. Uh, so basically, this is the uh, config file that actually makes this work. Uh, so what will happen, I'm just going to open it up, and maybe you can get a better idea. Uh, this, right here, uh, this part's not as important as this uh, right here. Basically, this binds this binds the one key to execute Dota, uh, and each ability like this is one one is I have set up for cold snap and execute the ability execute saying it'll it'll execute the ability zero zero for invoker is quas. So you can see it does zero zero zero. So it's quas quas quas, and then five is invoke. So whenever you hit one, it'll do quas quas quas, and then invoke. And it does it instantly because it's a computer and it's much faster than you are. So if I hit one, I have cold snap ready to go. If I hit five, it does one, one, one. And one, one, one is uh, XOR, XOR, XOR. And then execute hit five, that's invoke. So that's five is my sun strike. So basically, I'm going to show you how this works in game. Uh, we may hit a little bit of a snag when we try to do this because all this other stuff, it it has a little bit of a conflict with the invoker config. I don't even use invoker config anymore. This is actually something I've had for a while, but I, I don't ever really try to use it anymore. Uh, but yes, yeah, so we may we may end up I may end up having to reinitiate the config file a few times. We'll see how that goes. Uh, so I was testing it out a little bit earlier, and I had to keep reinitializing it. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put cheats on just so I can do WTF and get all my skills, whatever. Uh, and this is this is really cool. Some people, I mean, there's a debate on whether or not it's unfair. I'd say it's probably a little bit unfair, but it's really not that big of a deal. I mean, honestly, it's just it's just faster casting, and it's that's not that unfair. And chances are, unless you use this a lot, you're probably gonna fit with, which you're probably gonna forget which key is which, and you might have uh, which key is funny. Yeah. Go ahead and get all these. Ready to go. So to initialize the file, uh, this is actually this is what happened. This little part right here. Uh, this is what happens when my other config files initialize. Uh, 
they're automatically initializing. And you can set up the invoker one to do it automatically, but it doesn't really matter because it's just as easy as typing in exec. And mine's called invo.cfg, so whatever yours is called, you could call it 123 and you just type exec space 123.cfg or whatever. Uh, so hit that. It'll bring you down yes. to here, and now if I hit one, Where cold snap, two, there's that, three, chaos meteor, four, deafening blast, five, oh, maybe, oh, whoops, okay, one of them was not, uh, exhort, that was Wex, sorry. Uh, anyway, but that's, EMP, six would be tornado, seven would be ice wall, eight would be alacrity, Nine from the ghost wall. Do I have something set of zero? I don't have anything set of zero. So that means I don't actually have Sunstrike on here, and I probably could get it. I probably could put Sunstrike in there. I think I probably took it out or the just decided begins. I didn't care that much My because, uh, I mean, it's Sunstrike so is not that hard to cast. Also, if you hit Alt and W or Q or E, you'll see it's actually putting in a few at a time, but, uh, you just like double tap Alt and W, it'll automatically fill it up with Wex or Alt and Q, it'll automatically fill it up with Quas uh, and Alt and E. It's just a little, it's a slightly faster way to fill that up. It's not a incredibly crucial thing to be honest, but uh, if you're really, if you're really just feeling it. And uh, at this point, my uh, my keyboard well setup is already taken back over because I'm hitting one and that's putting me back on my character and that's should be invoking cold snap so if I wanted to do that again I have to inject invo. Uh, you guys wouldn't have this problem it's just this thing it's constantly trying to take so over so let's go over this again tradition. one cold snap two forge spirit three meteor four blast five emp six tornado seven ice wall eight alacrity nine uh ghost walk uh i guess my basic logic was for not adding in sunstrike which just that it was it wasn't that hard to just hit the ee and Sunstrike. But um, that's basically it for this video. If you have any questions, uh, please let, uh, let me know in the comments. If you have any suggestions or something you'd like to see in the next video, uh, just let me know in the comments. I read I read all the comments. If I don't respond, I promise you I've still read it because I get the I get email notifications for every single comment. And I always like to see what you guys are saying, even if it's negative. I will still read it. And I will still be glad that somebody said something. It's, Your bottom it's very important to me to uh, have a follower, uh, or followers. Uh, and anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you have a good day. See you later.